had done wrong, and yet he is treating it with all, for his wrong, he must treat also. If thou be for his prophet, he will use thee. But if thou have nothing, he will forsake thee. You know, that's how, he, that's how uh, Esau uses you know, the nation of Israel, man, when it comes to uh, entertainment, you know, for, uh, for example, like uh, football, the, the music industry. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah, praise the circuses, man. So if he sees a need of you, he's going to use you, right? Like you see, oh, he's got talent. We can make some money off of him, right? They make trillions of dollars promoting black on black crime in the, in the, in the, in the hip hop industry, man. They get paid off our people, man. That's what Kanye West, uh, Kanye West was saying, that they make trillions of dollars off the fact that they'll use us against each other and you know, to get a record deal. They promote violence, man. Verse 5 says, If thou have anything, he will live with thee, yea, he will make thee bear and will not uh, will not be sorry for it. Uh, so like let me let me read verse 7. It says, If thou be for his prophet, he will use thee, but if thou have nothing, he will forsake thee. If thou have anything, he will live with thee, yea, he will make thee bear and will not be sorry for it. So he's gonna take everything that he has from you. If he sees any kind of benefit out of you, hey, but you might be a good singer. Yeah, you might be able to uh, run a certain distance in a certain amount of time, you know? If you see something in you and he sees that he can make money off of you, he's going to use it until he takes it from you, man. Verse 6 and 7. Real quick, real quick, uh, I'm going to read that same uh, verse. This is a rock 13 and verse 3 in it, uh, GNT. It says, if a rich person wrongs someone, he can afford to add insult to injury. But if a poor person is wrong, he is forced to apologize for himself. Bro, can I read that again? Wow. That go right with that, yeah? Uh, I'll read this again. It says, uh, you, said, you said that was verse 4? Verse 4, verse 3. Verse three. Verse three. The rich man had done wrong, and yet he threatened him with all. The poor is wrong, and he must entreat also. Yeah, man, shit. Hey, hey uh, uh, you know, Israel, that's uh, uh, in, that, in that type of situation, man. Esau is gonna have him through either way. You, know, hey, you might, you might uh, be making, you might have a contract for like, I don't know what, four years, two years, three years, whatever, and you know you get paid that, event, uh, that, that amount of money. But if you go against what Esau, the, the, the women that Esau set up, he's gonna tax the hell out of you. Whether it be with like uh, uh, fines, or maybe you broke something in the contract. He said, okay, well, now you got to pay $2 million according to what it says here. You know what I'm saying? And uh, what it says over here, you did this, you know? And damn, like, like uh, you, know, you signed that contract, so you're pretty much bound to him. That's why the brothers mentioned that uh, that you have made an agreement with, uh, with, with death. Hey, boy, it said, I'll read one more time. Yeah, read that, so, Rock 13 and 3 in a GNT. If a rich person wrongs someone, he can afford to add insult to injury. But if a poor person is wrong, which is the poor in the scripture, the poor is, is, is known as the nation of Israel, man. And he goes into that, 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 that parable of Lazarus and the rich man. But Lazarus was a he was poor, he was a beggar, man. All right. So it don't matter that Kanye got money, he's still uh, uh, you know considered a, a poor. He's a beggar. He still gotta get fed from the plums on the rich man. Right. You know? Going back and says, if, but if the poor person is wrong. He is forced to apologize for himself. That's why you got those celebrities like Nick Cannon. They'll speak out, but then the next thing they gotta apologize. I want to apology. You know, here it is. This nigga showing you, bro, that this nigga is in control, man. You know, and like the elder said earlier, man, they, they ultimately they got stake in this world that they don't want to lose, man. They not. It wasn't their lot to go to, to to bring out the full truth, man. You see, to do what the man of the Lord, you know, the lot, of the prophets, man. The prophets are gonna bring it all, man. These dudes are gonna only go so far because they got stink in this world, man. Yeah, man they got, they got Kim, that's why they set up Kim Kardashian with uh, Pete Davidson, man. They making Kanye look like a damn fool. Like, look, 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 you know, you know, she had a kids with this man, and now all of a sudden she, you know, uh, you know, you know how they feel. Maybe they had, they told her like, look, we need you to go leave this dude and then go with him because he's not doing what we tell him. I don't know this whole situation. But, you know, hey, Kanye West might be saying, you know, might be saying NFL or whatever. So they had her go with the Pete Davidson, you know, deal with that, with, with him. 
to make Kanye look like a damn bitch, man. Like a laughing Yeah, like a laughing stock. You see how these people deal in Hollywood? Like, this is literally the, the woman of the, the mother of you know, your children. She, she, as soon as they say, look, you either do this or, hey, they might threaten her. You don't know. Like, hey, you gotta make this, you know, this dude look like a fool. Go do this. And then Kanye, that's why we, they had this whole thing with Kanye, Pete Davidson, King, the Kardashians. That's why they all relevant, uh, relevant right now. At the end of the day, you know, they don't, the reason, uh, uh, they have to, like it says, the poor man has to, to has to apologize. Right. It's because they don't want to lose them crumbs. You know, those crumbs that they're, that they're receiving from the rich man's table, they don't want to, they don't want to uh, lose those crumbs, man. And it's all because, and I'm going to bring this out real quick. Uh, I, this is Isaiah 28, verse 15. Because ye have said, we have made a covenant with death and with hell, are we in agreement? You know, so they're in, they're in agreement with, with death and hell, man, which of course we know, pursuant to the scriptures, who that is. Esau, the so-called self-proclaimed white man, man. He represents death and hell, that pale horse, man, which hell follows behind, which is the conditions that he's going to bring with those crumbs that he's given them, man. From those uh, agreements, those contracts, those covenants. It says, uh, when the overflowing scourge shall pass through, it shall not come unto us, for we have made lies our. So like, let me read that again. Uh, when, yes, yeah, come. When the overflowing scourge shall pass, pass through, it shall not come unto us, for we have made lies our refuge, and under falsehood have we hid ourselves. Because it's all lies and deception, man. At the end of the day, these niggas gonna get burned. They gonna get burned by this devil, and ultimately the, the Yahweh Bashi Yahweh Shai gonna burn their ass, man. You know, before it's all said and done, man. And that falsehood and them small headers claiming to be the men, uh, claiming to be the people of the Bible, man. They not the poor. They don't have to go around the earth and uh, beg for people from. Uh, you say what the poor man? You say what? Uh, no, the poor man have to go. Especially the poor man have to go beg for. Beg for forgive or ask for forgiveness, so to speak. When he's when he's wrong, these small had him not going around the planet begging for forgiveness, man, because of the wrong that they've done. Right. So the prophecy fits these people called the Israelites, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. That prophecy doesn't fit those people over there in the land, man. Uh, and the scriptures tell you back when you go into Deuteronomy, how it's going to be poor and, poor and crushed. How the hell are those small heads poor and crushed, man? They rule the fucking world, man. Let the hearing is they own they own the banking, they own all the banking industries, man. They own the music industry, everything you people, everything Jake try to get into, they are uh, the, the small hats own, man. Yep, yeah. They're showing you a key that they don't fit the prophecies, man. Right. You know? That, hey, that goes into like the brother going into Deuteronomy the chapter. It says uh, it says it says be on thy basket, you know, you, thou shalt be in fear of thy life, not not your day, not the paraphrasing. That's the curses, man. Exactly. And the view represents, like the scripture said, the view represents the world, man. Right. So no matter where you at and what you're doing, wherever you at in the, on the planet Earth, man, you're gonna be a, you're gonna be bound to that curse. Hey, those curses are the ones we lifted into the Lord lifted them up, man. Right. Exactly. You know. So how the hell these niggas over here run? Bro, these niggas, man, come on, man. When they get trillions or billions of dollars in aid every year, yeah, man. Like, 
That's why it says that uh, when you play stocks, stocks is a rich man. Game. But you have you have to have money to, to be able to you know profit up. Uh, like said at the end of the day, uh, uh, that that's because of the curses, man. All these things that Jake is going through goes back to the curses, and, and, and Jake don't realize, you know, Kanye, you know, because I think they try to say that he's a billionaire or something, you know, but he's still under the he's still under the curses. This nigga running around can't find his daughter, trying to trying to, you know, they having parties that he wasn't invited to. This nigga a billionaire and going through the same problems that the. the Broke Jake going through, just like Tyrese Gibson, man. Yeah. Crying, oh, oh, my baby, but, you know. What more do you want from me? Crying and shit, you know what I'm saying? They under the curses, which those curses going to be on, on them until the Yahweh shall returns and sets up his kingdom here on earth. This is Revelation 22. I'm going to start at verse 1, point in verse 3. And he showed me a pure river of water of life, clear as a crystal, or clear as crystal, proceeding out of the throne of the Most High, and of the Lamb, in the midst of the street of it, and on either side of the river was there three uh, was there a tree of life, which bare twelve manner of fruit, and yielded her fruit every month, and the leaves of the tree were for the healing of the nations, going into the kingdom of heaven, man. You know what I'm saying? Because everything is going to be perfect in the earth during that time. What the scriptures say in Matthew six and ten: Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven perfect righteous and order in the heavens man with the most high and that's going to be established in the earth so uh, verse three here's the point it says and there shall be no more curse but the throne of the most but the throne of the most high and of the lamb shall be in it and his servants shall serve him man so that's when the curses are going to be out these niggas man until then they under the curse don't care how much Oprah Winfrey billionaire she under the curses man Michael Jordan all of them you know Mayweather, all of them, they all under the curses, man. No matter what little money they got, man. The crumbs, like the like the Han mentioned. And there's something in society called a glass ceiling. Shalom. 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 You got something called a glass ceiling. The top of these bank families are above this glass ceiling. Your Jay Z's, your Oprah's who got this money, y'all not gonna get past that glass ceiling, man. You're not part of that elite group. So y'all just basically just rich slaves. That's it. At the end of the day, that's it. That's it. House niggas. I'm about to ask what you're saying. Yeah, you know, the, 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 the elites, their fortune is not even reported. You get Forbes, you know, 500, they don't even report that. Right, the, right, uh, right. They're above that, right? Right, right. And, uh, we know who, who's yeah. ruling because whoever's ruling is that person that you're not allowed to talk about. Right. Yeah. right? And as you're going into as far as the curses, right? I'm going to hold Deuteronomy 28. And 48, and it reads, Therefore shalt thou serve thine enemy, which the Lord shall send against thee in hunger, and in thirst, and in nakedness, and in want of all things. And he shall put a yoke around, yoke of iron upon thy neck until he have destroyed thee. Right? So no matter how, how you know, rich Kanye say he is, he's a billionaire, that doesn't even register with the elites. That's nothing. That's pennies on, on a dollar. Right? So he's still under the curse. Yeah, that's right, man. Hey, back then we might have had an actual iron yoke around our necks. But uh, according to, to the times that we live in, man, we have we have that uh, that uh, you know that metaphorical yoke around our necks uh, uh, under this bullshit, man. It's you know, we, yeah, we might not we not we might not be like this walking around with chains on our feet and yokes around our neck. But according to the society, through the spirit, that, that's how these people are, man. Because they fall, they fall by the ways of Esau. So if you if you were looking at Esau thinking like, okay, I need him to, to be able to survive, to get food, uh, you know, I gotta follow according to his ways, then you do have that iron yoke on that man. But that's why the scriptures say that if you, the truth that shall set you free, man. That, that's talking about us, man. Like with like we being able to receive that knowledge, wisdom, and understanding of the scriptures, we're set free from that yoke. You know? So that, that's a, you know, you can use that uh, scripture as a twofold, man. Yeah, we were in Egypt. Yeah, we had, uh, yeah, we were in America at some point in time with that iron yoke around, around our neck. But now we're still in that same situation, but we, 
we're able to set ourselves free through this truth. This Proverbs 23 and 1 is in a, in a GNT. It says, when you sit down to eat with someone important, keep in mind who he is. If you have a big appetite, restrain yourself. Don't be greedy for his, for the fine food he serves. He may be trying to trick you. <laughs> hey, man, that's our book right there, bro. Thank you. One Esau. Yeah, you know? Because yep. Esau always got to gotta trick up his fucking sleeve, yeah, man. Yep. Come with that contract. I'll let 100, 200 pay his contract. You know what I'm saying? Jake going to sign that shit because he wants some money. Uh, damn, uh, what a damn phone uh, uh, there. But they are signing bonuses or something, man. Yeah, you know? Yeah. It's always fucking our people out, man. But they don't, they don't think because they want to be rich. They want, they think money is a salvation, man. They think wealth in this society is salvation when these are uncertain riches, man. You know? Esau can, Esau can take that shit away at any time. That's why they, that's why these different celebrities that speak out like Nick Cannon, like Kanye West, they don't, they eventually got to apologize. I'm sorry for, for, for doing that because they don't want to lose that shit, man. Yeah, but they can make a song about killing me.
says you have, you have six you have six wishes. You can wish whatever you want. You know, but he didn't but she but the devil, the woman didn't tell him that there was conditions. Like he could he could, he could say anything like Man, I want to be a, a millionaire. Oh yeah, you know what I'm talking about? I know exactly what you're talking about. about. He wanted to be, he wanted to be an intelligent. Uh, yeah. Like one of, one of the curses was he wanted to be intelligent, uh, like a writer and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he finally got the woman swimming on the feet, and then she's like, she kissed him. She was like, what's up? She was like, what but that's like, but that's what 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 that's what
right? So this is Roman 10 and 2. It says, For I bear them record that they have a zeal of Yahweh, washing Yahweh, but not according to knowledge, right? He's worshiping a, 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 a white image, Christ, right? So he's equally doing wickedness, right? So that's falling on him. For they've been ignorant of Yahweh's righteousness and going about to establish their own righteousness have not submitted themselves unto the righteousness of the Most High. So we don't feel sorry for them, right? Without this knowledge, man, you're on your own. Whatever Esau does to you, that's on you. Because you're disconnected from your power. The true source, the true treasure.
Let me try this out. Sarah Sullivan, forget it, Sullivan. It's terrible. Yeah, they tried so hard to make them uh, sexualize them. And that whole Kate Kardashian thing started happening. They really, they tried so hard. Like, I'm talking about all social media was like, why is, so, why is T, uh, Pete Davidson giving off uh, these kind of vibes? Like, you know, like people trying to, like, making them attract, trying to make them attract them. Yeah, they couldn't do it, bro. They just like, damn, he's a weirdo. They just, they stopped that shit after a couple of months. They tried. They were in their power to destroy this dude. You know?
you know? When the kingdom of heaven is established, World War III, we're at, it's all, we're at the cusp of that, but we're, it's actually already started. There's just levels to it, you know? Malachites and the Israelis were the, the, the two children of Israel, man. Then why is there still war uh, happening on the planet, man? They they they've taken control of the of the, of the, of the, of the territory of Israel and named and, and slapped the name of the state of Israel and call themselves Israelis. But there's still you know earthquakes happening throughout the tsunamis. You know the the water's still shit. You know people people still starving. Right. You know what I'm saying? And where's your house, y'all at? You know? Yeah. I, you know that where, he's supposed to be up, up there ruling. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't make sense. They built the third temple, but where's the king David? You know? And then why is the law not being, uh, why is the law not flourishing? The law says you live not flourishing on the earth. Oh, uh, Satanism is responsible. But when we say these things, we're, you know, we're ostracized. Right. We're, we're deemed as crazy. Look at the word that you live in, man. Yeah. But it's right. But it's right by the, the very people who's supposed to be the uh, the beacon of light into the world. Right. Yeah, they're supposed to be the example. That suppose they, suppose they are, right, the children of Israel. We're supposed to follow after the example, but what example are they setting, man? Look at what's going on right now, man. They over there, they got, what's that one main city? Tel Aviv? They got, they got that, that one. Big uh, city. Yeah, that, yeah, big city. Gay parade. You know what I mean? There ain't nothing growing over there. They got, they, they have to have most of the, uh, I believe they have to have most of the, like, the trees and plants and things imported, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they threw over there, man. They ain't, you know, they ain't flourishing. Uh, they got to get aid from the, from the, the whore that said it on the beast itself, man. They get paid millions of dollars a year, man, uh, 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 by the, by America. Yeah. Other countries too. Yeah. This is Isaiah chapter 29 and uh, verse 19. It says, The meek also shall increase their joy in Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, and the poor among men shall rejoice in the Holy One of Israel, which you're seeing the beginning stages of that right now through these men right here, you know, and, and like-minded men, the beginning starting with Apostle Muhammad on down. It says, for the terrible one is brought to naught, which we're at the point of that, man. This devil is being brought down as we speak, man. His kingdom is falling, man. It's through. It's over. America is done, man. Finished. Benito. It's over. The end. You know, like the, like the movies be saying, Benito, the end. Uh, that, that's all, folks. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's what we had to spread, yes. baby. Let's <laughs> call all y'all. Let's call all y'all. This shit is over. This shit is through. We tired of this place, man. Yeah. Yes. It's redundant and old, bro. You see the same new shit. What's that movie with, uh, uh, what's that nigga name? Uh, Bill Murray. Hey, that's that's it. Ground all day, exactly. Yeah. See, we stuck in, in, in a loop like a bug, man. But it says, uh, for the terrible one is about to not, and the scorner is consumed, and all that watch for iniquity are cut off. It says that make a man because the, the, the elders uh, said that, man. We ostracize and, 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 you know, when we say certain things, man, you know, YouTube tripping, you know, Twitter, all of them, Twitter, all of them you know. It says that make a, a, a man an offender for a word and lay a snare for him that reproveth in the gate. And that's, we're reproving in the gate right now, man, you know, shaking the pan, you know, pointing at these devils, man. Let them know we know who you are. The elephant in the room is pointed out, man. It's over. Second Thessalonians said it, you know. This nigga had to be revealed, and he's revealed now, man. And these niggas mad. They they threw, they scared, they running, you know. So it says, uh, and turn aside the just one for a thing of not. And that's exactly what they do to us, man. Like we ain't shit. But they're gonna find out, man. Which the, the elite, they know, man. I'm talking about these lower level six pack, everyday six pack Joes running around here, man. Yeah, they crack it. 
first crop of slaves who come from the elite banking family. That's man. it. Yup. Amos 5 and 10. They hate him that rebuketh in the gate, and they abhor him that speak uprightly. There you go, man. That, that, that's how we looked at, man. Well, that's how we've been looked at and throughout the whole history of the world, man. And it's, uh, uh, throughout all the, the, the kingdoms that have been risen up, and we, we try to say something, you know. Uh, the Lord raised up the prophets, and we say, hey, man, look at the place. wickedness. Peace. Not after the way of the Lord, you know what I'm saying? That's how we looked at, man. Yeah. I got to see the NLT, Amos, the NLT, Amos 5 and 10. It says, how you hate honest judges, how you despise people who tell the truth. Hey, that reminds me of, uh, what is that in, uh... But you got paid off lies. You right. got trillions of dollars off lies, yo. Yo. Uh, uh, Ross Aldrin, uh, what's their name, the damn fake-ass astronauts? Oh, uh, uh, like Bud, 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 them niggas got rich on lies, man. Deception, you know? And then, then they get uh, uh, confronted because their videos where they're, they're confronting them about things for the, the truth coming out now. And this nigga wanted to fight. Oh, yeah, you know? Him, you saw that? Put his hand on the fight with yeah. yeah. Oh, this nigga wanted to too. fight, bro. Yeah, he's ready to fight. Like, nigga, you yeah, know. Hands smoking. Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> I can't touch it. Bro. Lies, man. That's what I'm saying, bro. Just to answer your point. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right. I mean, but that's some shit. We try to say something, point it out. And now we be we the ones that, that are uh, uh, extremists. You know what I'm saying? We going too far saying like, like no, this is uh what's it called? These are conspiracy theories. Right. But then the dudes that was doing conspiracy theories back in 2006, y'all making documentaries off of it. You know, but we now now we being demonized for being conspiracy theories. They're not making documentaries about what we talking about. Right. You know, we're not making money off of this. Because they do, because they know deep down the side that this going against them, man. Right. They know that's why I ain't gonna put this on the mainstream. Right. But, but uh, yeah. come soon, you're not gonna have a choice. It's gonna be on mainstream in a minute, man. That's right. Hey, that that shows the power of uh, yeah. how about you trying to trying to affect the hands of the knowledge. That let the truth come out that the so called Negro is, in fact, is like something. It's to the point to where they have to let that truth come out. Right. right. Now it might be for their. Uh, Right. 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 Have a, have a trade himself. But rather, you can always find who can make money. So that's why you have a lot of these Jewish individuals that they lean on in entertainment, that industry, football. They own everything, right? But uh, 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 they were not able to create that themselves. But they know who we are. Oh, the talent of right? yeah. so They know who we are. So they know how to, they can, they can scout talent. Right. It's like that movie, uh, 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 Cadillac, uh, Cadillac records. Cadillac records. Yeah. Right? Yep. You guys ever saw that? Yep. Well, that, that Jewish guy, yep. he had a talent of finding, you know, uh, uh, a chance. Yeah, yeah. And yep. instead of paying them the money that they, that they deserve, he'll pay them to buy them a Cadillac. Give them a little money to pay bills here and there. Yeah. Right? No legacy for that guy's children or right. his wife. He just said, 
the car is yours. What, what, what you need? I need to pay. But okay, just take that. But, but taking all the money he had made from all the records. He made hella money. Give me ten thousand dollars, man. Yeah, that nigga didn't have enough uh, money for a funeral, man. Yeah. When he when he died, you know, they had to collect, you know, to try to bury this dude, man. Uh, Lil uh, Lil Walter. Lil Walter. Yeah, that's yeah. Right. That's Lil right. Walter. Right. Right. Yeah. 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 Jerry Springer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, about him. Yeah, Mark Yeah, Mark Yeah. Wow. Wow, he's a sport. So now they hate the man that rebuking the gate because the scriptures say he lifted up the skirt of the wicked and show him and, and showing the world and the nations this uh, shameless man, all the shame that he's done to these people, man. But now since your skirt being lifted up, now you don't want to talk about it. But it's written in prophecy, and it has to come out, man. The so-called Jews, it, it, it has to come out on you, man. Right. That's just what it is. So we ain't got nothing to lose. You can't fuck with us. Because right. we cause we had no ties in this world, you see? I got, I got he ain't worried about this. Nah, he ain't worried about us. You can take my little $500 in the bank account. You can take that shit. Fuck them. See, all I got is $500. Yeah. <laughs> right. We got it up. This is Job 18, verse 5. Yea, the light of the wicked shall be put out, and the spark of his fire shall not shine. The light shall be dark in his tabernacle, and his candle shall be put out with him. You know, so he saw, you know, he's, he, all, all that he has set up, all the, you know, the people look at him and they see him as a, uh, as, a, as, a, as, a, as a type of God. You know, they come up to him and say, okay, you know, we need, they okay, I see, you know, these so-called white people, they don't, you know, our people don't really see any flow in them. Right. That's gonna come, you know. It's gonna be shown, in, and, and, and that and that light that they see in him is gonna be put out, man. Cause that's how that right now he saw these people look at these so-called white people like, okay, no, they 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 not the enemy. Right. We we they looking at Joe Biden like, okay, well, you know what what can he do for us? Or I mean, I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. What what how you know what is he gonna give us? You know through this whole you know crisis. Know, to, to, that's gonna aid me. You know, uh, they looking at him like, okay, gas prices looking up, uh, uh, going up. Okay, he, he let that them them oil reserves go out. Now, gas is going down a little bit. Okay, okay, I see you, Joe Biden. That's how these people look at him. That's how these, these so-called white people look at. Uh, I'm sorry, how Israel look at uh, these so-called Edomites, man. Like they look at them, uh, look at them, and say, okay, well, where can I get? Where can I get aid from? I need help with this. I need Medicaid. My, my, you know, my kid is sick. What, 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 what can I do? You know, what I'm saying I, I, I'm, I'm low income. What program can I, can I go through with these, with these Edomites to where I'll get some aid? You know. So, they, so they, so they looking at Esau like, okay, he is the man that I, I can depend on to provide for me, right? And it says. Uh, the steps of the, uh, the light of the wicked, sh or the light shall be dark in his tabernacle, and his cannon shall be put out with him. The steps of his strength shall be straightened, and his own counsel shall cast him down. So it's going to get to the point where Esau is going to uh, uh, do himself in, man. You know, hey, he, uh, 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 he, he's, he's out here right now, you know, pretty much delegating things, you know, like, uh, uh, okay, we're going to do this, we're going to do that. But then within the, the council itself, they, 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 there's a, there's in, uh, what's it called, like one word of the words or something like that? Uh, there's a word to it. Pretty much they fight within themselves. They, uh, whether it be the Repug Republicans or the, uh, versus the Democrats, you know what I'm saying? Or, or even the nations itself, man. They, they, they gonna, they, they gonna do themselves in, man. That's why I said that. It says, uh, for he is cast into a net by his own feet, and he, and he walketh upon a snare. And 
that goes into a lot of these uh, these laws and, and commandments that he put he putting now. Yeah, the own righteous decrease, man. He's gonna catch himself up with that. Like just for example, these uh, weapons of mass destruction, or whether it be uh, him selling weapons, guns, uh, different uh, technologies to these other nations, man. That, he's setting up a snare for himself. They they gonna use that against him. You already have Edomites of, uh, of a different lineage, like Russia, uh, 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 America, you know, the, the European nations. You know, they're all Edomites, but they all, you know, they they in different coalitions, man. It says, uh, the snare is laid for him in the ground and a trap for him in the way. So all these deals that he's making, and all these different coalitions throughout the whole world, they already plotting against them, man. They plotting against themselves. So that snare is already set up, man. Whether it be the, the nuclear warfare, World War Three, you know, they, that that snare is set up. He already that uh, that trap is already there, man. And it says, uh, terror shall make him afraid on every side, and shall drive him to his feet. Man, and that goes into when these other nations really turn against uh, America, man. Like, yeah, uh, yeah, you saw, you know, he saw it itself, but America is the one that's going to be hunger bitten, like the scriptures say. Everybody's going to, everybody's going to turn their back on them. And they all Edomites. Yeah, you got these other heathen nations, but mostly these Edomites. That's why the uh, the uh, uh, said that, man. Uh, nation divided of its. Uh, uh, a nation divided cannot stand. Esau is hella divided. treaties against my will piling uh, one sin on another <laughs> verse 2 it says they go to Egypt for help without asking for my advice they want Egypt to protect them so they put their trust in Egypt's king but the king will be powerless to help them and Egypt's protection will end in disaster people hey man like I said man it's going to end in disaster for you trusting in this place trusting in Pharaoh man you know it talks about that uh, that staff man the man leaves his hand upon it and pierces his hand, man. You see, that's what our people, that's what our people are about to get, man. That's what they has been getting, but they ain't so fucking stupid. They don't realize it, man. Get it, man. They don't realize that this place has never, it's, it's, it was never founded and set up for you to to, uh, to be a part of it, man. Right. Only to be slaves in this place, man. You know? But a nigga, a nigga would still have hope in that, man. Yeah. Well, one day, we need to get somebody in office. Yeah. This nigga that had all these people, ain't now, now, now one of them did shit for Damn one. Nope. Man, you bitch cards, man. You just fool, man. We just so happy that you got a little change now. There's a lot of bitch cards that's doing well. And then there's a lot of bitch cards that's just naive. You know? Like, what you have, like, like, there's no, there's, there's just no continuum in this place, man. You come around here thinking that, you know, you come to the land of free, or you just go place it in your, uh, your board, your property, whatever. You, 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 but believing in this place is going to be your downfall, man. This was very comfortable down here, bro. Oh, 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 man. Love it, love it. Be cool to you. Love me some white man. Yep. They think they're white themselves. So called yep. white themselves. You that tribe. Psalm 62 and 9. Reads, surely men of low degree are vanity, and men of high degree are a lie. <coughs> to be laid in the balance, they are altogether lighter than vanity. Trust not in oppression, and become not vain and robbery. If riches increase, set not your heart upon them. So, 
Kanye West saying that he's a billionaire. He said that over and over and over, right? As if he's untouchable. He's a made man. Right? How did he make the billion? He must have done some filthy stuff. You know, you just don't get billions like that, right? Hey, he said it, bro. He said it in that uh, Drink Champ, uh, uh, that Drink Champ interview. He said, "I don't care if you show a video of me fucking a girl." He said that. That nigga said it. He said, he said, it, he said, he said what? He said he don't care if they show a video of him popping a girl. Bro, who said who? They can't they can't say that. That. Poor bitch. They do that when you go to these fraternities. Huh? They'll make a, a, a dude that wants to get in. Snatch it though. They're filming that. Yeah. 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 Ah, got you. Bro, he's so, he, he's so into this stuff, bro. Yeah. He's so into this stuff, bro. That, that one, uh, that one show, Black Mirror, the first episode, the first episode, it was about like a, I don't know if he was a governor or something, so he was a higher rank or something in politics. But they was pretty much saying like, look, we either kill your daughter or something like that, or you fuck this pig on live television. Yeah, I've seen this. You know what I'm saying? But hey, but that's how he saw deals, man. Like, you want to be exposed or, you know, you this and that, or, or you do this. We want to see you, you know, smash, smash, smash your bitch. So you look this way, this shit. So you they got your little girl? Yeah. You get what's up? Get a little yak in your system. Yeah. I can't do it. Yeah. Give me that squid. Yeah. Yeah. I'm looking like an ex. Hey, shit, uh, what's that one not show? Uh, <laughs> superheroes, but they're like all wicked and shit, uh, Pretty much, this this one chick, she has superpowers, and she's trying to be a part of the top elite superheroes or whatever. And uh, one of the guys says, "Well, uh, you know, uh, you gotta give us some head for you to, you know, to join." You know, and that's how it is with these places. It's a man. Criminal, man. Yeah. Hey, uh, Dave Chappelle called him out. He said he was making a deal with one of them, uh, one of them guys, the man, the man, uh, what's it called? The, uh, guys that manage everything over there in Hollywood and then he, he was talking to him and then he just took a line of copes right right in front of him and said okay this is what we're gonna do you know what I'm saying but that's how you know you know you see the the manner of the, of the way of these uh these higher ups man yep. you never hear their names you never see their faces but you only hear of, of, of the, uh, the, uh, the you know the lower ranks <laughs> Terry Crews, right? He complained about some juju grabbing his balls or some oh, yeah, ass uh, or something uh, like that. Yeah, right? But he's still getting those high dollar boots. But you know who Jake, uh, you know who uh, came at him? Jake. Jake came at him for his post Yeah, yeah. You notice? He ain't would have been in half uh, movies like that. He do a talk show. He on a, he on a, uh, uh, He's on a, a what? A very good guy talent? He ain't got no Sylvester's alone, uh, boomers. <laughs> you know? Yeah. So he, he made a sacrifice. He said, no, I ain't with that. So everybody, Jake was, was, was with the people that were coming against him. Yeah, he was with Yeah, Zessie and Zessie, you're out Y'all Hollywood niggas should have enough of this, man. Damn, bro. You got the money, still ain't happy, man. You probably come out to the script. Yeah, he said, he said, damn, 
they got footage. Yeah, bro, you let it be known. Like, yeah, I did it. I don't care if you show it. You know what I'm saying? That's how you know this is a spiritual growth. Because uh, what you describe, it's time to like, uh, the God pain. Yeah. Half of the half goat. Yeah. Yeah. Half the half man, half goat. Half the half man, half goat. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Half the half goat. I didn't get that. That's basically all of it. That's true. Right. And uh, I, I used to hear rumors a long time ago. Right? We used to get a lot of these cases where uh, uh, you have to put an animal down because that animal, which is a sheep, or some type of livestock, gave birth to a half half human, half sheep. Right? It's going to do the people. Right? They, they like that beast out. So they said it's just put a lot of things down. Like, think about that. Right? Strawberries. They'll put fish DNA, you know, in strawberries, so that it'll, it'll last during the winter. You know, so it's like, man, like, damn, bro, like, what, what, why, why, why do that? You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to. At the end of the day, the, the Lord set up, a, 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 you know, a rule to where, like, okay, you're supposed to grow these these things this time of this time of the, the, the year, and then it's like a Sabbath. And, uh, for example, like when we were out in the wilderness with Moses, they, they had them six days to, you know, eat the food that the Lord gave us. And then they were supposed to save, on that sixth day, they were supposed to save to make it last on the seventh day. You know what I'm saying? That's, 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 how, that's how it's supposed to be with the earth, man. You know, because with the earth, you're supposed to grow, you know, you know a certain time and then leave that plot, let it, let it, yeah, we recover, revive, and move on to the next one, man. But Esau don't do that. You know, he 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 drains the hell out this earth, man. That's why we say that's why people that's why nothing really uh the vitamins and nutrition that we that we supposed to get, man, we don't really receive them. I think that's because uh, Esau that curse that was put on Cain is also on, on Esau. Right? Uh, 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 uh. He has a hate for the earth, so he's trying to destroy the earth. That's why he's always talking about going to Mars or leaving the planet. Right. 
when there's tons of resources still here. You wanna because the earth hates you, you hate the earth back. That's why you fracking up, you you, you miss a, misusing them. You're not trying to grow back what you you know, you just wanna destroy it. It's just death incarnate. Yeah. Earth will make the last forever to Right. Don't hurt the women. Don't hurt the women. Don't hurt the women. Black friends are like it's going to be Jeremiah 11 and 16. It says, The Lord called thy name and green olive tree to bear a goodly fruit with the noise of a great tumult. He had kindled a fire upon it. The branches of it are broken. So the Most High had looked at and called Israel uh, a green olive tree, man. You know, a strong, powerful uh, tree. You know, so that's how we was. You know, that's how we were as a nation. But it says that He had kindled fire upon us, and the branches of us of uh, it were broken off. You know, burnt off. You know, it tells you why. It says, "For the Lord of hosts that planted thee had pronounced evil against thee." For the evil of the house of Israel and the house of Judah, which, have they, which they have done against themselves, to provoke me to anger and offering incense unto Baal. So Most High has broken those branches, or burnt those branches off, and burnt that whole tree as a whole, representing the, 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 the nation of Israel, and or uh, uh, representing Israel and Judah, man. It says that they have done it unto themselves. So we did that, man. You know, the, hey, it wasn't that, the, you know, that we found fault in the Lord and said, You're, we, 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 we in the situation because of you. No, we in the situation because of us. Hey, we, as the scripture said, man, we have, uh, you have, we have provoked the Lord and we've done these things unto us. You know, roughly paraphrase it. You know, so it says. That's why that second covenant is coming, man. Because it says that the first one they break because of, and they were at fault, man. No, it wasn't the fault of the Lord, man. It was us, man. We went off, you know. Yeah, the law. Hey, like this, I think in that same scripture it says that the law is perfect. Mm -hmm. you know, the law that was given was perfect. So if there was no fault in the law, but the fault was in us. You know. Hey, but hey, that shows you the mercy of the Lord, man. That He was willing to work with us. That's why He sent you how Like, look, uh, uh, what, what is it in Isaiah the first chapter? Though your sins be as scarlet. It shall be white as wool. Let us reason together, save the Lord. You know, let's make you know the Lord telling us like, look, well, let, you know, let's 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 talk about this. Come to the table, man. Come to the table. The Lord is very merciful. There's a whole uh, book in Psalms 136. The whole chapter, the whole uh, 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 the whole that whole chapter is uh, about the Lord's mercies, the Most High's mercies, man. Isaiah 50, uh, what's that? 54 and 8. Speaks of the Lord's mercies. Then you got the tender mercies of David, the sure mercies of David, man. The Lord is very merciful when it comes to his people, uh, his people, man. You know? I'll bring that out, actually. I don't want to. Just to make that point, this is Isaiah. Right. Going to Isaiah 50. Say what? Going to Isaiah 50. No, okay. This is Isaiah 1. It says, verse 18, Come now and let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet, thou shalt be as white as snow. Though they be red like crimson, they shall be like wool, man. So the Lord was willing to uh, forgive us for all that, man. Even If you see the example... With all the examples throughout the Old Testament of all the wickedness that Israel did, all the evil, you know what I'm saying? The Lord, the Lord was still willing to, to, to cut a deal, man. Like all you got to do is just turn back from your ways, which has always been like that. Just turn back and come back unto me, man. Yeah. Just repent, yeah. yeah. Jeremiah, the second chapter. You know, you have, uh, hewn, your, uh, you have hewn yourselves out cisterns that hold no water and have forsaken fountain of living waters man that's that's the history of israel man that's why we in the situation that we in that's why we can't grow nothing man we can't have big we can't be up there like esau
Jake have no judgment in their way. Oh, come on. See? You got it right. Yeah, man. That's the, that, and, the, and the nature that, the, that Israel is right now, man. They need to be they need to be put to death, bro. You 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 over here, you, you walk in with some, some with a blue shirt. And the dude over there wearing a red shirt saying, I don't like the color you're wearing. Right. Yeah, bro, that's your stupid you know, so, you know, you know, things like that, man. Right. Like, oh, you looking at why you staring at me? You know what I'm saying? And they hook up, hey, what the fuck you staring at? You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, Pitch. You know, but hey, but, you know, the, the things that, that Israel against Israel, they'll, they'll put them to death over, over colors, man. Or the, or the type of shoes they're wearing, or the, the, the way they, they talk. You know what I'm saying? That, that's why these, most of these two thirds got to be put to death, man. They they not looking at you saw not looking at his faults but they're looking at their own neighbor saying like oh I, I don't like that color I don't like that color you you represent knowing damn well they don't they not even representing nothing man they just walking down the street representing death that's all that's all yeah. it is man but hey this place is gonna be destroyed two thirds of Israel is gonna be put to death Israel uh, Esau is gonna be put into slavery man and that's right. what it is man that's right, right. brother and so with that we want to give all praises to Yahweh, 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 Yahwe